Parade Watchers! It is time to talk about another history character. Today we'll be looking into a snowman that the company is trying to get him to be the most iconic Disney character along with Mickey Mouse and the gang Tinkerbell and Stitch. And that is the lovable happy snowman Olaf from the most iconic Disney animated movie feast from the 2010s Frozen as he appears as a giant balloon in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. We start up in 2017, where Olaf made his parade debut to remote his 30 minute or TV special, Olaf's Frozen Adventure, which was already playing in theaters before Disney Pixar's Coco, with Walt Disney Animation Studios as a sponsor. His design is, well, you guys guessed it, a generic design. It's not that special, of course. Joy for generations, the celebration of this special holiday is really just beginning. Floating into view is the first and the newest of our 17 massive character balloons. Melting our hearts, there he is, Olaf, the happy snowman from Walt Disney Animation Studios' Frozen, the number one animated film of all time. Olaf joins the parade's elite band of giant character balloons for the very first time, measuring in at 57 feet long, with a carrot nose, get this, as long as three snowboards. And you can see more of Olaf with the brand new featurette, Olaf's Frozen Adventure, in theaters now, paired only with Disney Pixar's movie Coco for a limited time. He will continue on in 2018 to remote his Broadway show, Frozen. Here is a crowd favorite, Olaf is a lot in the sky for the hit movie Frozen from Walt Disney Animation Studios. Has the hardest working snowman in snow business at 57 feet tall and 32 feet wide. If the Olaf balloon were made of actual snow, it could cover the surface of the Matterhorn Mountain at Disneyland. I did not know that. Olaf and friends can currently be seen on Broadway and Disney's newest musical, Frozen, featuring all your favorites, plus more than a dozen new songs. This unforgettable theatrical experience launches a North American tour next year. This lush Yule time. And then in 2019, where he will be somewhat retired, he will promote his sequel, Disney Frozen 2, which was already playing in theaters the week before Thanksgiving. Also to promote their Disney mobile app, Disney Plus. In total, Olaf has made a total of three appearances in the parade's history, if it is. Because as of this recording, this was announced in 2020, a year when the parade went virtual, if you're watching this after the 2020 parade or in the future. So we don't know if Olaf is going to come back to, to the parade or a future one. But speaking of which, I do need some batteries for this next character. 